valves. Um, April 1st was our deadline for the uh, community block development grant. And uh, we did not make it. Okay, we did not make the deadline. But that being said, uh, it doesn't preclude us from filing again next year. And uh, I talked to uh, Mike Jacobs, who's uh, with the uh, uh, Regional Commission. And he said, that's okay, don't, don't flip out. He goes, you, you know, they have a, uh, a dashboard that will show you how you're scoring. And right now, we were not scoring very high, so if we submitted it, we, we would have crashed and run. But that being said, the surveys are good for two years. Mm. OK, and uh, so we're, we're good on that. We, we do have some tweaking to do on those surveys. Um, so some of us have some reapproaching to do on them, but we'll get those in, in order. But what real, I mean, this is the day before the, uh, the deadline came. Um, it came to my attention that the, the main cutoff to the water valve to the, uh, to the big water tank um, had not been turned for quite some time. So we went out there and we turned it, and guess what? You broke. It don't, does not turn off the water. Um, after you and I spoke about that, I got to do some thinking. We've got, with the county, on either end of us, it's pressure released. Our pressure is lower than theirs, so when it senses that it's lower, it mm -hmm. automatically dumps in to a, automatically comes to us. We need to go up there and manually. There is a way we can manually shut there, shut them off. So you think that the county is it's possible? Is, okay, when we shut. First of all, the the, uh, the valve did not turn very much, and I and I was cranking on it pretty pretty good. It took a while to get all the dirt out. It hadn't been turned in quite some time. Um, turned it and it didn't do anything to the uh, fire. We had the fire and it didn't do anything. So I said, okay, so then we have a secondary shut off outside the fence. Mm -hmm. Turn that, it worked. You know, there's three right there. That's the, the, yeah, that's the one, one it, it's the one of our three. That's and the secondary. All, that, all those three do, one cuts completely off the, right. the tank. Right. The like, other two are directional. Right. Okay. Under, east, east and west. East and west. And, then you, and behind them is a secondary cutoff. Right. Hit the secondary cutoff. But and at first it didn't. No, it didn't. It didn't work. But then we hit. Then we hit. Once we shut those valves. But when we hit the west, it worked. It shut off. It did. Yeah. It shut down significantly. So okay. there was still water flowing through, and that's probably the kick. The kickback from the county. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But i um, real concerned about those two uh, valves not, not doing what they're supposed to be doing. So I call Mike Jacobs. Um, I don't know how expensive it is, but there is an emergency grant that goes very quickly um, to replace those. And my suggestion, this is just me, you know, those three valves that are outside, put them inside the fence. I don't like the idea that they're outside of the fence. Now, it was very difficult opening those covers and getting to them, but I don't like the idea of those valves being outside of a secured fence. So maybe with that emergency funding, we can move them back into uh, the fence on the infrastructure. Well, first of all, I hope that we're not putting this in the minutes so that people know that they're outside the fence. Well, they put that, but yes, I agree with you. Know, they need to be in the fence. They, or I think, we would move the fence, right. include them or something. Well, if you move the fence, you're going to be in the, uh, um, in the close to where the water, you know, the, uh, where the water goes. The drain. The drain. The drain. Right. Well, that's okay. I mean, I know we talked about moving the fence, but yeah. They but if you're going to replace those, those valves, and I'll tell you, if we're replacing the primary and the secondary, might as well do these things. They're all the same age. Just do them all. So we have some fresh valves. I don't know yet. We've got um, a level coming down to us a, a, a look. Um, but we might as well replace it. They're probably from 1967. Mm -hmm. So when we get the new valves, we'll put them on a maintenance schedule to be turned. And they just need to be turned and, you know, every, I don't know, once a month at least. So. Is, 
does the grant money um, cover whatever the cost of them are, or is it spent on that? It covers 50%. Right. So we have to come up with 50%. So we'll have to come up with 50%, which is better than 100%. Oh, yeah. You know. So we're going to work a level, we're going to get that taken care of. Is a lot of them charge us for it? Because, I mean, this is still part of the work project. You've paid it. Yeah, I'll talk to them. I'm going to say, okay. Yeah. Cut us some slack. They, they know what for. Okay. The part